I think it was huge. Um, love to see the turnout, even in the conditions that we had. Super excited about what we got coming next week. Um, but I think we did a great job going out and scrap, scrapping, fighting through all the adversity that we had with the weather and the football and you know everything that we had from the outside pressure. We did a great job of fighting, channeling it, and leaning on each other and going out and getting a win. So uh, really proud of that. It was awesome. Rush for 200 yards today. How does that help the offense just grow from week one to week two? Yeah, I mean, I thought we ran the ball well in week one. I think we just kind of really started to complement it well with everything that we were doing. Rather than just calling really great plays and executing just great plays one at a time, as a whole unit, we were able to string together drives that mattered and, and everything kind of matched up. I thought we did a great job of that. We, we, that was an emphasis at practice, and we were able to come out and trend and execute it uh, today. So, super excited. Chris Godwin's a guy you've talked about a lot. What about his game today? I thought Chris made a lot of really good plays. Um, some plays that just seemed very easy to him that were actually pretty difficult. Uh, so. I'm excited to see what that brings to the table, but we got a lot of guys out there that can do that, so we're really excited about what what what, what dynamic that brings. I think they're awesome. You know, uh, I was able to uh, connect with Hack on a deep pass, so it was, it was really able to give our team some momentum. And so I, I think that was big for our, for our offense, is momentum and and moving on uh, in the game. What can you say about the job the guys did up front? 200 yards on the ground, no sacks today. Big day for the offensive line. Yeah, definitely. I, I definitely think it was it was a big momentum thing for offensive line. I, I think now uh, that they can see like. Uh, what they can do and, and what our office can be. I, I think this is big for us moving forward. How do you grow from here? What's the next step for you? Uh, honestly, I, I think right now we, we can watch the film and, and learn from our mistakes that we made because uh, there, there are there's mistakes in every game that you play. And I think for every we got to learn from our mistakes and, and not make them move forward. Uh, we played fast. We ran all over the field. And uh, we played as a team. We played together. So definitely a good turnout for us. Carl had a really good game. Zettel, uh, Sickles, all the, even the young guys, even the guys who we rotated in, they had a good game too, so definitely good to play as a team. It was pretty incredible. It was just like everything I dreamed of, besides the weather, but you know, that's Penn State blue collar type of weather. That's our type of game, and you know, I couldn't be more excited for the direction this team's heading right now. Well, I think we communicated very well, and that was the big thing for us going into the game, you know, step up our communication, and that's what we did. So it showed on the field. We still we still have some things we have to clean up going into this Rutgers game, but all in all, it was a great team win. How'd it feel to get in front of the home fans? It felt, it felt great to get in front of the home fans. It's something we've been itching to do since you know the spring game was over. So we are very happy. We are very excited, and we're just glad that we were able to get a W for them. Uh, it was great. It, um, I was real excited. I had a great time. Uh, my first game ever in Beaver Stadium. Um, I dream about this ever since I committed here in February two, uh, two years ago. So, I mean, it was awesome. It was everything I expected. Uh, it was raining, it was a lot of rain, and still a lot of people was here. So that just shows how supportive uh, our fan base is and how great our fan base is. What did it feel like to get in the end zone? Uh, it was awesome. Uh, my first college touchdown, I'm never going to forget it. I didn't know what to do, so I just gave the ball to ref, and it's, the rest is history. But uh, I was a little upset that I didn't score the play with, uh, the drive before. I thought I should have got in. I slipped, but hey, got to play the next play. But it was excited. I'm excited and just happy I got into the end zone. What can you say about the guys up front? 200 rushing yards. Oh, they're awesome. They, they were great. Uh, we came in here with a, we came in this game knowing that it might be a little rainy and we said that we we're going to run the ball. We we're going to run the ball. We we're going to ground and pound. We we're going to punch them in the face, keep punching the face. Um, a kill started off and then uh, I got in in the second half and we just kept punching and kept grinding. The old line was setting up holes for us. Everyone sees the, what the running backs do, make the plays, make the big plays, but you can't not do anything like that without the front, the front guys. They did a great job and for, without them we would not be anywhere close to 200 yards.